If you have an old iMac with a spinning hard drive or even the Fusion drive, um, here is how to make it fast. So firstly, you need to get one of these SSD. Um, I just stick it on a normal hard drive. Um, so this SSD got a way faster speed to write and read. So when you attach that to the back of your Mac, yep, and then you're good to go. So after you plug in the SSD into your Mac, um, the first thing to do is to check the status, see if you can see the storage. Um, so as you can see, uh, I'm already uh, utilizing the SSD as the main drive. And then the one terabyte uh, disk, that's the normal hard drive, that's the internal hard drive. Um, so now I use that as a backup drive. Um, so all the software is running in the SSD because the SSD is way faster than a normal hard drive. Um, so what we're going to do first is to erase all the data in the SSD to change the format into the one is suitable for um, Mac to run it um, as the main drive. Then you want to choose the format of Mac OS Extended Journal. And you have to use the GUID format as well. Of course, I'm not going to erase my existing data. Um, so after you erase that, you can then go to the App Store, type in Mac OS. You can choose whatever OS you like. And then when you install it, you install it in the SSD instead of your existing hard drive so that the new system will be running in your external SSD. After you complete the installation, you can choose the startup disk by going to the option. Uh, as you can see, there are two drives to select. Um, I already select the SSD as the starter disk, so it will run whatever system in the external SSD instead of the uh, instead of the internal one. Then all you need to do is just to restart your computer, and then the computer is gonna utilize your SSD drive as the main drive, so all the Mac OS and software should be installed in that drive. Um, therefore, it's gonna be real fast. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one.